Hello, this is Laptop Media, and today, we will show you how to open the Dell G167630 and what's inside of it. To access this notebook's internals, you need to undo 10 Phillips head screws. Then, lift the bottom panel away from the chassis. If you plan to access the cooling solution, you need to undo two Phillips head screws on the inside, and four located on the back of the device. Please remember, it would be of great help to us if you just hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. That would motivate us to make even more and better videos for you. Our configuration features an 86 watt hours battery pack. It lasts for about 3 hours of web browsing, or 3 hours and 30 minutes of video playback. To take it out, unplug the battery connector, and undo the 7 Phillips head screws that secure the battery to the device. Memory-wise, you get two SODIMM slots that work with DDR5 RAM. As for storage, there are two M.2 PCIe X4 slots. One of them fits 30mm, while the other fits 80mm drives. They both work with Gen 4 SSDs. To continue the disassembly you first need to remove the Wi-Fi card. After that, unplug all connectors from the motherboard. Then, remove the USB Type-C metal bracket. The next step includes the removal of 8 Phillips head screws that secure the motherboard, the two daughter boards, and the fans to the chassis.
As you can see, there are two heat pipes shared between the CPU and the GPU with one more allocated to each of them. A total of four heat sinks and two fans deal with heat dissipation. In addition, it looks like there is a vapor chamber that assists with the cooling process. If you'd like to see more disassembly videos of the latest notebooks we would highly appreciate if you hit the like button and subscribe to the channel.